Hello and welcome to this learning video. In this learning video, we are going to start with one of the very important topic of differential calculus that is Taylor's and Maclaurin series for one variable. So before we directly go into this topic, I would like to tell you some of the very wonderful applications of Taylor's series. So Taylor's series has its application in numerical methods. In numerical methods, what exactly uh, Taylor's series do is, with the help of Taylor's series, uh, you can find out the approximate solution of the first order differential equation and uh, where the initial values were given. So it is also called as uh, initial value problem. So with the help of Taylor series, you can find out the solution of the initial value problem. Let us see one more uh, application of Taylor series. So Taylor series has its application on calculators and computers. You know that to calculate the approximate values of almost every functions on calculators and uh, on computers is done with the help of Taylor series. Okay, so without wasting much time, let us start with the topic Taylor's and Maclaurin series. Alright, so let us see to it now. So we have a Taylor series. So let us start with the statement of Taylor series. If f of x plus h can be explained, can be expanded in a series of ascending powers of x, then f of x plus h can be written as f of h plus x into f dash of h plus x square by 2 factorial f triple dash of h plus x cube by 3 factorial f triple dash of h. Alright. Now this is what we have is expansion of the function f of x plus h in ascending powers of x. Same thing you can do in ascending powers of h. So what you have to do is just replace just replace what exactly you are going to do? Just replace x by h. The moment you replace x by h in 1 you would be getting the expansion of the function f of x plus h in the ascending powers of h like you can see h, h square, h cube and so on but sometimes what happens sometimes you have to uh, you have to expand the function just f of x in ascending powers of x minus a or to find the Taylor series expansion of the function around some point x equal to a. In that case, what you need to do is you just need to replace you just need to replace uh, x by a and h by h by x minus a. Say this is to be say this is to be your equation number two. If this is to be your equation number 2, then you can do this kind of replacement here, okay, in 2. You would be getting the Taylor series, okay, around the point x equal to a. Now, you may be wondering, like I have given the name of the topic as Taylor's and Maclaurin series for function of one variable and we are talking again and again. Uh, about Taylor's series or Taylor's theorem, why not Maclaurin? So, Maclaurin series is nothing but the special case of Taylor series. The moment you substitute, the moment you substitute a is equal to 0, okay, in this Taylor series expansion, you would get a Maclaurin series. So, can you help me out in writing down the Maclaurin series? What you need to do? Just replace a by 0. So I would be getting f of x is equal to f of 0 plus what is this? x into f dash of a plus x square by factorial 2 f double dash of a is 0. plus x cube by factorial 3 f triple dash of 0 plus and so on. Okay, what is this? This is actually a special case of Taylor series and we call it as 
Maclaurian series. This is Maclaurian's series. Okay. So, with the help of these four results that we have written here, we will make use of these results to find out the series expansion of the function. Okay. So, in the very next learning video, we are going to take problems on Taylor's and Maclaurian series. So, on a concluding remark, I would like to say how to remember this uh, series. You always think like here you see, whatever is the derivative, there is a factorial. Like here, two derivatives, two factorial in all these things. Okay, student get confused so many times with how to remember this. So, at least remember one and then you just replace. Okay, the most uh, Common used, uh, commonly used expansion are this and this. Maclaurian series, you will uh, somehow get it like which one to uh, when to use Maclaurian series. All right. So this is what we have in this learning video. In the very learning video, we will take the examples. Okay. So thank you for watching and enjoy learning mathematics. Thank you.